Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. This one is a quick tutorial. I'm gonna show you how to improve your compositions. Not only that, I'm gonna show you how to set up the rule of thirds. I'm gonna show you how to change the color of your guidelines and even how to save it as a template so you can reuse it in the future. Here's an example here, the rule of thirds is set up and I've got this uh, exercising lady doing those weird battle rope things here on the line here. But if we look at the original crack, this is the original shot, she's in the middle, centered, and I just set it up so that she's on the rule of thirds. Let me show you how to do this step by step. All right, so for those of you that are following along, just grab some footage, drag and drop it into your timeline. I've got this attractive lady doing battle ropes to build bigger forearms or whatever the heck this is for. All right, here we go. So the first step is you wanna go up here to view, but here's the thing. In the new version of Adobe Premiere Pro, when you click on view, you'll see here, I wanna add a guide, but it's grayed out. What you have to do for some strange reason is you have to click on the program panel actually click on the video in the program panel and then you're going to see some options. Show rulers, make sure there's a check mark be sh beside show guides, like this here, show guides. I'm gonna do it again, just to check mark it. And then the next step is to add guide. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And now here's how you do the rule of thirds. A lot of people will say, hey, you gotta put it in by the pixels, you don't. What you need to do is you need to use the units as a percent. And watch this, I'm gonna type in 33.3 and then I'm gonna go ahead and use this as percent, and then it doesn't matter. We're gonna go with horizontal first, but what you need to do is you need to basically chop this up into a grid of nine. So by doing this with 33.3, .3, watch this. This is exactly one third of the way down. I'm gonna go ahead and do that again. I'm gonna go to view. I'm gonna add another guide and it's gonna be horizontal. This one is going to be 66.6, .6, also from the top. Presto, now we're gonna switch it up and we're gonna go the other way. So I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna add another guide and this one's going to be vertical, 33.3. .3. And then the last one will be 66.6. .6. We're gonna go to view, add guide, 66.6, .6, same one. Look at that, this is a perfect composite. Now, if you wanna go ahead and change the colors, just right click on the guide and then go to edit guide and then right here you can see obviously change the color i've got bright yellow because it's nice and easy to see but usually it defaults to some sort of teal color but there you go so now we've gone ahead and created that now if you want to save this the last step here is you want to go to view and then watch this we're going to go to where are you add guide so we've added in the guides we're going to lock the guides now we're going to go ahead and create a template so we're going to go to guide guide templates save guide as template. So we're gonna save this and then we're gonna call this 4K, uh, this is a 4K footage uh, rule of thirds. All right, cool. And then you can go ahead and just, you know, move this person around. So if I wanted to go here, I can go into my effect controls panel and then watch this. I can scale her over here. So there she is. She's on the, the I guess you could say one of the thirds. And if I wanna scale this up so she fits a little better in there, presto, easy to do. And that is how you do it inside Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching.